25 times 5. Can we get a blue? Come on, EA. Reward me. Blue, let's go. What is it going to be? Portuguese. Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm Michael, aka The Crusher, and today we've got episode number 223 of The Road to Ronaldinho. We're back with the Premier League team of the season and the EFL team of the season with a big pack opening. So let's get into it. So yeah, over the weekend, a lot of stuff has come out. Um, obviously, we've got team of the season swaps now. You see the Willock objective. So we'll start with the objectives and the SBCs, then we'll look back at the two teams as well. So first up is Willock. Pretty decent card, 90 rated 40 uh, swaps token as well. Um, Premier League Cups here with lots of different little bits. My favourite part is like the uh, the player picks, I think one's an 84, which is pretty cool. We've got Saka and De Gea, again, two nice cards. If you don't use them, it's good fodder. Um, De Gea, I'll probably give a go. Uh, obviously, I have Lloris as well. I made a mistake on him, but I'll talk to that about why, um, why uh, when we go for the main team. Uh, in terms of SBC, has been quite a couple of nice ones, I'd have to say. Uh, obviously, got Flashback Deli Alley, which looked like a very, very nice attacking centre midfielder. If you put a shadow on him, he's going to be on 90s as well. So, that's going to be a very, very nice card to have indeed. Seeing some good things about him. Obviously, we've already had uh, Joe Gomez. We've got Team Season Harry Kane, which is slightly expensive. I think it's about 550k. High, high work rates. Obviously, uh, 590 plus stats, but... Even with an engine, will he turn like a truck? Most probably, so I'm probably going to avoid that for now. Uh, Morgan Gibbs-White is an exceptional value. Uh, he's a 90-rated card to an 83-rated squad. Um, in terms of other little bits, obviously, uh, Benzema's Play of the Month card came out, 94 rated, so I can imagine his team seems going to be a 97 or a 98. We've got the usual sort of um, team season challenges. Obviously, that gets token. Um, we have the 93 20 kit, which is pretty cool. Uh, and then on Sunday, we've got the 92 plus icon moments upgrade. Exactly the same requirements as the uh, icon moments upgrade that's gone before. So that was yesterday's video where we got uh, Socrates. Um, but yeah, a lot of stuff has come out. Now, on to the uh, team season swaps. We'll get on to a minute. Also, at the moment, you can only see officially the two icons. But if you do want to check it out, it is on Twitter in terms of um, what the, the rumoured um, swaps rewards are going to be and I just need this items releases to refresh come on otherwise it might be a home screen job come on try it once more no okay we'll go we'll just go into squads uh, and show you that way Obviously, this is my uh, main squad and obviously we've got Larice there so yeah Larice dropped to a, from 150 to about 110 I believe um, and that's because Allison is in the uh, the Premier League team season. But yeah, let's go through that Premier League team season and the EFL team of the season. So that's team of the year. That's team of the season. Like so. Oh, I messed that up, Hannah. Uh, so let's go team of the season. Concept on in Premier League. So Mo Salah, Ronaldo, two incredible cards. Salah's got full star, four star now. Uh, Ronaldo, lovely dynamic image as well. Sadio Mane looks like an incredible card. Five-star skill. He's got KDB, Jao Cancelo, Son. The fastest goalkeeper in foot, I believe, ever. Uh, Alisson with 91 speed. Ruben Diaz is less than his uh, Team of the Year card that I've got. Van Dijk I'd absolutely love from rewards. Um, all this pack opening because he can partner him uh, perfectly. Um, Bernardo Silva would be a very, very nice card to have as well. Um, apparently, he's very, very good in that cam role. Uh, I can always switch to a 4 triple 2 we got Bruno, Trent, which would be a great um, CDM. we got Declan Rice, uh, Jota as well. Um, obviously, Fred is community. Rodri's the lowest rated one, which is a bit of a shame. If I pack him, I'll probably use him as my defensive midfielder instead of Sissoko um, with a shadow because then he'll get 90 plus pace. Uh, but he's the cheapest one. He's around, I think he's around 30k when I last checked. So not much, but yeah, he's be a, a decent player, no doubt. In terms of the, uh, the championship, We've got uh, Mitrovic, which looks an incredible player. I think he's about 300k. Medium, medium isn't the best, but I think with an engine, he goes to a 97 in-game striker. Harry Wilson looks like a nice card as well, because he links into that Mitrovic. Solanke, we've got Wyman, which looks like a, a ridiculous card for a, for a cam. I mean, 95 pace, 90 shooting, 90 dribbling, 91 physical at 5 foot 10. Three-star skill moves lets him down slightly, and obviously the agility and balance isn't the best split, but that could be quite an interesting card if you're rocking a, an EFL team. We've got Swift. Spence, who's always had a great season at Forest, and uh, Naismith as well. When he didn't he used to be a striker, I'm sure he's a striker when he was at Accrington when uh, we were in Berry's League. In terms of League One, we've got Twine, Keane, Balassa, Cooper, which obviously please, please 
Typeface and uh, Barry Bannon. This twine card looks pretty good and I think he's quite expensive. The 99 agility and 99 balance. And in the League 2, we've got Gufferick, Cadden and another former Barry player, Dominic Telford uh, with 99 agility and a balance. Like if I get him, he'd be a perfect super sub um, for me with that Barry link. But yeah, in terms of the team, I'm looking to change it. Um, off the back of this pack opening, hopefully we get maybe one or two team the seasons. We have saved packs quite a bit now. Um, and yeah, we've done like a five minute intro. But yeah, we're going to open everything apart from the league specific stuff. Um, just because, yeah, I think this is probably one of the better ones. And obviously, we're going to have swaps packs as well. Depending on the back of this, what we do with the swaps packs, we might save it for like uh, the ultimate or even like league and for that Mbappe. So we'll start with the 11 times 81 plus Premier League pack. Can we start with a team of the season? That is the big question. We're not, but it's going to be an 86 plus walkout, and it is going to be Jaden Sancho. So, decent fodder in there. Um, hopefully, some more stuff as well. Cavani, Henderson, uh, Maguire, a couple of 83s as well. I'll happily take that. And Maguire is tradable. Perfect stuff. A lovely way to start. Two Man United players uh, and some good stuff. So, next, we'll go with the five. I oh know, we'll save them for the end. Actually, we'll do one now. We'll do the 86 one now and do the 5 times 85 at the end. So the 86 double upgrade. Could we get a double team of the season? No. We're going to get an inform Italian centre-back. Oh, Bonucci. I couldn't remember he was in team of the week then. But obviously that would be good for uh, fodder reasons. And an 88 Kalo Navas. So not too bad from that. No team of the season. So we're not on eight teams in yet. But pretty decent indeed. Let's go for the 50k packs now, whatever we've got here. This one's got an 83 minimum guarantee. And we're not getting a team of season in that one, which is a bit of a shame. We've got Trippier in that one. So we'll clear for the duplicates, send the ones that we can. Up to the transfer list, like Baklav. Um, hopefully the rest of these are dupe tradables, just because I don't have that many untradable cards in my club anymore. And they all are, so that'll save us uh, further down the line. Where are the other 50ks? Right, okay, so we've got two more 50ks. Um, these don't have a rating, so I presume these are some sort of rivals rewards. I think they will be the rivals rewards because we've got two of them exactly. First one, not even boards, so we'll just skip that. We're not interested in, uh, not even the walkout, sorry, it is boards. Um, but yeah, we're not really interested in uh, the boards at the moment. They're literally probably worth maybe two or three K. We want to see the blue team of the season. Cancelo's probably the main one because obviously it's a perfect link into uh, Ruben Diaz, but yeah, I mean, I'll take any sort of. Uh, Premier League team this season, work them into the team somehow. Maybe that Allison as well. I've also got rewards um, from Weekend League to come. We need to start playing that. It's currently Sunday night. So, yeah, I think it's almost until Tuesday or Team of the Week. Um, so, we'll probably play quite a bit off camera um, and then probably play the first five on the last five of the Mondays and Tuesdays episode um, just because it makes it a little bummer easier to manage. Um, so, obviously, last week was on until Wednesday. I think this week is only on until um, Tuesday morning is that all the 50k is done now it is all the 50k is done now so now i'm on to the 100k packs we've got quite a lot of these i think i saved some from the season refresh as well this one's gone 84 plus guaranteed and it's still only boards yeah i've uh not had much pack luck today we've got 12 dupes in there as well which one is coates which also just used um Slara as well. We'll just click some the ones that we can't push up, um, and hopefully on Monday we get um, some upgrades. Supposedly um, league specific uh, rewards. So the Premier League 25k pack will come back. Hopefully we get some sort of player pick as well. Um, but I'm not too sure if they will, because obviously the Premier League is quite a high in demand league, where they'll give us that easier chance to get a team season. Um, but yeah, we'll just uh, move all these to a quick sell. We've, we've got plenty of coins over 900k. We've got plenty of packs to open as well. Second 100k pack. Can we get a walkout at least? We've got Jane and Sancho in the first one, and it is a walkout. Don't tell me it's Benucci again. We got Benucci in form twice already. Great. Um, and we get Thomas Muller, so that's pretty decent. What else is in here? We've got another Harry Maguire. So we'll probably have to do something with them um, before we move on, just because an 87 in form and an 84. It's, it's a fair bit of coins, so um, once we sort through these, we'll, uh, we'll, move, we'll move the low value ones down into the quick sell uh, and then work out what we can put those into uh, and then come back for the rest of the pack opening. And I've quite a few of them been able to move up. These we're not able to. But yeah, I'm going to pause it on my end uh, and then, yeah, let's go and find someone to put these in. So I decided to put these into uh, the first squad of Flashback Daily Alley. I've said in the intro, I've had a lot of good things about them. Uh, him and we've got 11 days to do it. So got plenty of time to get some fodder into the club. Uh, away they go and we've got to get a premium at gold players pack from that. Hopefully it can give us something good, but 
If not, no worries. It'll give us some decent, probably tradable players, who I think it is. Um, and we're one squad out of three after that flashback deli out, which could be an incredible card to get into the team. But yeah, no, uh, no even boards there, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, we get Zaha, which obviously team season last week, not this week. Um, so yeah, we'll, uh, we'll go through the 100Ks now. I think we've got a couple that have a guaranteed rate, a couple that don't, and a couple of tradable ones as well. But yeah, still no sign of a team of the season, which is um, a bit of a shame. We're getting 85 De Bruyne or De Bruyne, um, and a lot of untradable cards here. So uh, yeah, we'll uh, quickly fire through these. Um, but yeah, I think even if even though the, we might not get a friendly team season, the cost of them is quite low at the moment. Like I saw Bruno was like 130k earlier today. Which is a, a bit of a surprise. Obviously, it was a bit of a surprise inclusion in the first place. Um, obviously, we know Chelsea players getting in at all. Um, he's made it in. Obviously, it's part of a, a fan vote as well. Um, but yeah, very surprised he made it in. But they're, they're quite low. Um, some of the players are quite expensive. Like I think Jao Cancelo is quite expensive, uh, which is the main one that I want. Um, walk out 86 plus. It's going to be Steels. Again, decent fodder. I might already have him, but hopefully not. No, we don't have him, which is good. We're still getting a lot of dupes, though, um, which, again, is a bit of a shame, but yeah, that's going to happen when you've got quite a, a stack club um, and not really using the lower stuff for, for much at the moment. In terms of like other stuff, um, Harry Kane probably isn't going to be done. Um, the new moments pack probably isn't going to be done unless we get something mad uh, or some mad sort of dupes over the next sort of week or so, um, just because I think it's a bit of a, a waste of fodder, um, and I'd rather put it into like some of the, the sort of specific league specific stuff that's going to be coming out um over the sort of next few days as we head into um what's next bundesliga team season i believe it is uh so we'll open the tradable 100 case now because if they are dupes we can shove them straight on the transfer list we get an 88 plus walkout i have skipped it who is it going to be it's a dupe and it's going to be harry kane okay not too bad shame he wasn't in team season in svc but pretty decent tiago silver and luke shaw in there as well so just put all these up here. Uh, transfer list is getting quite full. Um, and we have got quite a few trailer packs to open as well. Another one coming up now. Coming out eighth team of the season. No. Where are all the team of the seasons? I've seen so many people pack them. And I'm just not getting anything at the moment. Which is a, a bit of a shame. But yeah. Once it's sort of full we'll uh, move the sort of lower stuff down and uh, quick sell them. Uh, so we'll save that for last. Got 100k there. They're uh, untradeable. And two. So we'll finish on the ultimates. They are tradable. So we'll open them uh, 100k first. And still no team of the season. Cool. We get two informs. But yeah. Informs are pointless at the moment. Um, especially the low rated ones. Obviously prior to this when they were quite high. Whereas this one there. There's not much value in them. Which is a, a bit of a shame. Um, and yeah. Obviously, sort of requirements are going to switch for team season quite soon. They already have done for like the guaranteed stuff. So the community team season required one. Oh, no, sorry, was it community? Yeah, the community team season required one. The Premier League team season is going to require one. Um, and the Premier League one's probably like an 86 rated squad. Um, so it's good to get some fodder uh, back into the club. Final 100k pack now. Can we add a blue? Come on. We don't, but it's going to be Tony Cruz. So decent walkout fodder. Nonetheless, is there anything hiding behind him? A dangler? Yes, we get two walkouts. Marco Verratti in there as well. Um, and 15 dupes this time. Um, how much is Ilicic worth? 3k. We'll quit yourself. Not too bothered about that. Um, Matip is tradable. Lovely stuff. Boland isn't. Lopez isn't. Neves isn't. Uh, it's mad. Like Whenever you open packs, you never really get the team of seasons. As soon as you go out of team of season, they appear all the time. I've seen Zaha. Fred's there. I had Graven Birch earlier. FIFA works in mysterious ways. Uh, but hopefully we can get at least one blue from this pack opening. I've saved packs for uh, a fair bit. So it'd be a bit annoying if we didn't get them. Sinistera. Another one that had a, a team season last week. Move all those down. So yeah, we got um, two trade all packs. And then the 85 times 5 from the European top 5 leagues. We've got to get one, one blue in that, surely. Um, and it should be a Premier League. But Ultimate isn't giving us anything. Terrible. PK, get 484s, but we get 16 dupes, including Harry Maguire. Um, rest of the stuff, we'll just quick sell. No point even looking through that. We'll get the uh, 8,500 coins back. Last ultimate pack of the opening form. Move on to that final pack. Can we get a blue? No, we're going to get an inform. Croatian centre mid. Yeah, no idea. 
feature team of the week, 84 raid, but again, decent fodder for any sort of uh, future stuff. And Sterling, which is pretty good. So we're getting fodder back into the club. Um, just no team season, which we wanted to see. Let me ask the recording. We have been calling for quite a long time, though. So, um, yeah, it'll be uh, over soon if you've stayed this way, uh, all this way. So thank you much if you have. Um, and then stuff like Caicedo and stuff like that, we can move down. And sort of have the 84s, maybe an 83. Um, there could be a lot of cards that might sell in this, but we'll just quick sell that for uh, 14,000 coins and move on. And then the final pack of the video is the 85 times 5. Can we get a blue? Come on, EA. Reward me. Blue, let's go. What is it going to be? Portuguese, centre mid. It's Bruno Fernandes. Probably one of the worst ones to get, I'd say. Um, and they haven't fixed the um, the walkout sort of card. Obviously, the, uh, the render. But no, that's our eight team season. Bruno Fernandes, obviously, this time last year, he was very expensive. This time this year, he's 130k, 120k. Um, so, not the greatest, but we'll take it. Four star, three star. The three star doesn't help him, but we'll take it. It's our eighth blue um, and some decent fodder there. To Stegen is a dupe untradeable. Um, so, we'll put him into the Deli Alley squad off camera and then probably complete Deli Alley. Probably have to reward, so... Maybe Wednesday's video will uh, complete Deli Alley. But yeah, that's going to be it for today's episode. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. If you have, hit that like button. Let us know if you've packed any Premier League team of seasons and how many you've packed. And most importantly, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. <laughs>